and Ali today. I'm going to read you a story. Fairy Ella transforms fairy hunters. Are you ready? Yeah. I'm gonna ring the bell and say the and say a warning, but the chief and the villagers doesn't listen. You must drink it all while napping. No, the dragon really. I told you that the dragon has a duty to protect our village, and we're strong enough to defend ourselves too. Now go home, dear. I'm sorry that my daughter has caused a. This dragon's cheap. It's fine. Now everyone, go on home. My stew must be cold by now. Mom, I'm telling the truth. You must believe me. Calm down, Ella. Let's talk at home. Warm tea will make you feel that better. Do you agree with Chip? Chip, do you think I dreamed it? No, I believe you, but but what? What is it? Chief has a point too. Even if your message is true, there's still no reason to be worried. But the dragon, we've had a long day today. Let's sleep and talk more tomorrow. Everything that happened today seems like a dream. Was it all really a dream? What Chief said. Oh, I don't even know anymore. At this rate, they'll catch us. Let's all split up. Hurry, boo! Get out of there. Got you. Hansy got caught. We have to escape. Ray, watch out! Fairies of the lake. We finally meet. Now you're rats in a trap. You'll never escape. <gasps> rats in a trap. Ugh. Really, ugh, rats in a trap is when them, you know, a bit. Mm hmm. What should we do? Let's use water magic. Come on, we have to combine our powers. Oh, spirit of the lake, empower. Us with your strength. Ooh, what on earth? Surprised, I'm Queen Lake, and this is the magic of the lake fairies. You're a bit bigger, that's all. Get her right now. I'll get her. No, I will. Ha! You're no match for me. Splash! Ah! Ouch! That really hurts. Ow! You idiots! You don't deserve to be called fairy hunters. But boss, she's too strong. Hm, whatever. She's still just a fairy. Tell her a little help. Water magic is it? How amusing! How are? Who are you? Back off! If you don't want to get hurt. How cute! That's what I was going to say. I see wind. Blast! Oh, what's this ice cold wind? She's frozen stiff. Ha! Serves you right. He. <laughs> I can't move. Now you know my powers. Undo magic. The ice is melting. <laughs> They've all fainted. Good job, Kala. You're one powerful sorceress. Oh, this is nothing. There's one here too. Found one. They're so tiny and cute. The nobles will love them. We got them all. Excellent. Let's go home now. Wait. Did you know there's another fairy village not far from here? Really? I have no idea. It's called Leeville, and the fairies who live there look similar to humans. That's interesting. Tell me more. They're unique because they can transform. 
transforming fairies? Whoa! Fairies as rare as them would be a good price. What are we waiting for? Let's go raid the village now. There is just one problem. A dragon protects the village. The dragon? Really? I'm afraid so. That makes things tricky. It will be tough to go against a dragon, right? A baby dragon is nothing, but an adult dragon is a difficult opponent. Then I guess we feel this out. Phew! I won't give up just yet. This year marks the 100th year of the dragon's guardianship, which means a dragon's vow of protection ends after a hundred years. When its time is up, the dragon leaves. Ooh, the raiding leader will be child's play. Oh, that's why I've been moving the dragon's movements. I, I can always depend on you. From what I've observed, the dragon's movements have been erratic. Excellent. Once the dragon leaves, we'll begin hunting. In the meantime, I'll create a weapon to attack the transforming fairies. I can't wait. I'm excited just thinking about it. <gasps> what is it? Did you see something? No, nothing. I just felt like we were being watched. You must be tired from all the magic you used. Let's go home and get some rest. Blub, blub. I hope Ella has relayed my warning well. Danger is looming, Ella. What are you doing now? She's sleeping? Ugh. That's a bit. <laughs> you know. Um, a bit. <laughs> That for me. Where am I? Um, I was fast asleep in my bed. It's just a minute ago. Oh, I must be dreaming. Let's see. Ow! Ouch! <laughs> that really hurt. Is this not a dream then? Have you relayed my warning? Oh, great dragon! Did you tell the villagers my morning? Yes, I told them, but they don't believe me. They dare ignore my prophecy? They're not igno ignoring it. Rather, they're tr trusting that you won't break your vow. Foolish fairies. If they trust me to keep my vow, then they should heed my warning. Oh, and also, yes, speak up. They think they can protect the village on their own even if you leave. Tisk tisk. They're overestimating their transforming skills. All right. If that's how they feel, I can leave with peace of mind. Wait, you're leaving? I stayed in one place for far too long. Now I'm free again. What about your bow to protect Leafiel? A dragon always keeps its promise. And I did it. But you just said you were leaving. That means you're breaking your promise. My promise was for a hundred, a hundred years. I don't understand. My promise was to protect Leafiel for a hundred years. And today, that promise has been fulfilled. Take care, child. I must have my leave. No, no, you can't go yet. Let go. I must leave. Really a bad feeling? Maybe it is. A really bad feeling? Two minutes.
But what if the hunters really attack? The sun has been up for ages. At last Sunday doesn't mean you can be lazy. But it's the only day I can sleep in. Smack! Come on, get up. I have a meeting to go to. Make yourself some breakfast. Okay, Juan. Hmm. I'm so tired. And it's been over a week since Great Dragon left. And nothing bad has happened. I guess this was right. I was wrong for nothing. What is it, Chief? Why have you called, called for us on a Sunday? I just have major, major news. I'm afraid Great Dragon has got the forest of secrets. Are you serious? How do you know the dragon has really left? Because of the dragon scale. This dragon scale has been passed down from chief to chief. This scale glows bright when there's a dragon nearby. Are you telling us it no lo longer glows? I am. A few days ago, I went to the forest of secrets with a scale. Then before I can only conclude that the dragon has officially left our village. My goodness, Alice's warning was right. What now? I fear. And said us. Chief, is our village in danger? Let's not react rashly. But now that our guardian dragon is gone, we need to be patient. We'll be okay, right? We'll be fine. If any attack us, let's teach them a lesson. That's right. We'll all transform and fight them all. Will we really be safe? Hello. I'm too bored. I know Chief told us to stand guard, but there's nothing to guard. Yeah, let's just hang out a bit longer and then go. Russell, Russell. Huh? Well, hello there. How lovely to meet you. Very hunters? We must warn the village. Not so fast. Whoa. Oh, we can't let you go so easily. Mm -hmm. Fine, then. let's take them down ourselves. Sounds good. Transform. Ugh. What's on, what on earth? We can defeat them if we attack all at once. Smack. Ah! Please let me go. Yikes, we're outmatched. Kala Kala, I'll take care of them. Serpent of Restraint. Find their powers. Ugh, I can't move. It won't come off. Ugh. Holy smokes, our transformation have come undone. I can't believe this. Don't just sit there and grab them. How embarrassing. Who knew there was magic that could undo our transformations? Impressive. Once again, you've exceeded my expectation. You flutter me. Done.